就像你说的，我们这个展览有呃四十多位艺术家，两百五十多件这个艺术品，这对于我们来说是最大体量的一次展览。那困难呢，就可想而知。这么大型的一个展览，我们从艺术家的一个选择，从，呃，整个的一个一个运输状态，包括我们的资料收集，以及后期的一些所有的工作，都是巨大的。因为其实这一次展览，很多这种草图性的东西，是代表这个艺术家他们的温度、他们的 DNA、他们的这个、他们的心情。他们的情感，代表着很多他们自己的东西，很私人化的东西，所以我希望公众进来的时候能感受到这一点，能够感受到这种，呃，浓浓的这个艺术家本身的这种东西。I gave this title, Intriguing Uncertainty, because they speak about the uncertainty, which is not absolutely and only negative, because it means also we are not so certain, we are not so sure, but we are much more open to look other ways, because we don't have one way. This intriguing character is also positive because it doesn't close and doesn't give ready answers. We must go in, we must go see, and then we discover a lot of things, positive, negative, frightening, or, or beautiful, and that is the life. So this exhibition speaking very, very much about contemporary life. You don't find here any so-called uh, structural drawings, uh, geometric abstraction, uh, certain kind of formalistic structure. It's completely open. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Thank you all for coming to join us at the opening party for Intriguing Uncertainties at the Parview Museum of Singapore. Our new friend and the old friend, and enjoy all the other artworks and uh, have a fun tonight. Thank you so much. I would like to present the artists who are today with us, uh, Sandra Vasquez de la Horra, uh, an artist from uh, Chile, originally living in Berlin, Guglielmo Castelli from Italy, actually living also shortly in Berlin, Iris Levasseur from France, uh, Kerstin Grimm from Berlin, from Germany, and Alois Mosbacher from Austria. Uh, we are very happy that uh, uh, they came here and uh, some of them helped us during the installation of the exhibition. Thank you very much for your time.